Hey everybody, I'm Jesse the Apple Ninja. Thank you very much for joining. During the day, I'm fortunate enough to be able to be the lead senior Macintosh engineer for uh, a Fortune 5 healthcare company that um, I just am fortunate to be able to work on all this Apple gear and I learn a lot about it. So I bring it to you guys and I try to share some of that information that I find um, and figure out, right? One of the things you're going to want to make sure that you wait until the end of the video because uh, I share my Apple Ninja site of the week. And this week it's uh, a, a site that really does a lot of like different hardware reviews and things of that nature. Really big into all sorts of different Apple uh, topics. So definitely going to want to check that out. And if you're not subscribed, get subscribed right now. I'm going to pause just for a minute so you can click the button, get subscribed because it helps me build the channel, you know what I mean? And uh, I, I'm trying to do my best, but I need you to back me, you know what I mean? So let's do this together. Click the button, click the alert thing, and hook me up, man, because I'm going to try to hook you up with all these videos and stuff. So, all right, in this session, though, we're going to be going over the iPhone magnifier. It's a super cool feature that Apple created, basically intended to zoom in on things to allow people that maybe have eye issues or what have you um just the ability to see stuff and zoom in on stuff and magnify stuff um so i'm going to show you how to set this up uh two different ways so you can uh access it through an accessibility option which we're going to set up and then you can access it through the control center option which we're also going to set up and then we're going to go over through a little tutorial on how to actually use it and the different features it has. It's actually slick. And during my testing, I actually can zoom in farther and closer to objects far away than the phone can, the phone camera can. And I think what it's doing is it's using the, the camera phone, but it adds an extra zoom onto it that I'm going to be able to show you. So it's super slick. Um, and I, I just, I, it's awesome, man. So let's check this out. All right. So let's open up settings. So we're going to do the accessibility option first. We're going to go down to, okay. So we're in settings. We're going to go down to accessibility and magnifier. And within magnifier, we're going to click toggle on magnifier. And you can also toggle on, you're going to want to play with this auto adjust exposure and I'll just toggle it on for now. And then we're going to go back out of magnifier and out of settings. And we're going to go into control center because we also want to set this up in control center. We're going to click on customize controls. We're going to scroll down to magnifier and we're going to click the green plus next to it. We're going to see it up in the top, click out of this. So now what we're going to be able to do is we're going to be able to see the magnifier in our control center. You're going to see this little plus down here. Yep, you're going to see that down there. And when I click on that, it's going to bring up the magnifier. And now, as you can see, I'm zoomed in. I can zoom in extremely far. I can zoom in. And that's the video that I'm shooting. So then, if I want to add more light, I can use the light if I want to focus and make sure that it captures and focuses on that. You're going to see the little lock ends up locking down there because it's locking the autofocus. So then if I want to take a snap of this, then what I do is click the center button and now I've got a picture of it. I can exit out of this. And since I actually did enable 
the accessibility option as well i can triple click the side here to access it as well so now i'm going to triple click and i'm back to but as you notice it still has the freezed frame that i took before so if i click on the screen you're going to see that the, it's yellow i can zoom in on that guy zoom out whatever and or uncheck it to go back so now when i'm in here i can also do these if i hit, click this little icon down in the right hand corner for the colors so i can adjust different things like brightness contrast but then i can also flip this so it's inverted or i can select these different white blue invert it blue yellow invert uh, uninverted grayscale it's inverted to black and yellow uninverted so you got these different options all the way through and i can pick any one of those white inverted so this is perfect for zooming in and then if I don't want this anymore, let's say I just pick the blue and white and I actually like this. I can just uncheck that, right? Down in the, or not uncheck it, but click that little icon down in the right hand corner. The little color icon to bring us back to the main screen. So now if I snap this and I push the button to freeze the frame, if I click freeze frame, it it basically, it zooms in. But look at, I can just use my fingers to pinch and zoom in on that, right? Or, one sec here. Or if I want to save this picture, all I have to do is click on this guy, hold down, and go to save image. And now I've saved that image into my photos. That's iPhone magnifier. I mean, this thing is super slick. To be able to access it from control center, to be able to triple click it from an accessibility option is pretty, pretty dang slick. All right. All right, guys. So the Apple Ninja site of the week is IDB or idownloadblog.com they provide a wealth of information around iPhones, all sorts of Apple related stuff, as well as other tech related stuff. They do hardware comparisons and different reviews of hardware. You're gonna see stuff on iPhones. You're gonna see stuff on jailbreaking iPhones. It's all sorts of stuff on this website. I mean, if you scroll down, you are going to find all sorts of apple geekiness on this website so definitely swing by give them some love uh it's a group of writers and editors that are all from around the world that are creating all this great content for the site so definitely show them some love for the great content that they're providing and uh guys i can't thank you enough for all the support you guys are giving me um it's absolutely fantastic if you guys have any awesome websites that you want to share or you want the world to know about, please leave them down in the comments. If you uh, are using some cool tricks with this uh, iPhone magnifier, I would love to hear how you're using it. Um, and you guys just have an awesome week, man. All right. I'll see you next week. Take care.